Hello, in this video we're going to look at the government spending multiplier with income taxation. We're going to look at a situation where the government spending multiplier is 3 and the income is taxed at a rate of 20 percent. We're going to try to solve for the marginal propensity to consume. So once again, here's our problem. The government spending or purchases multiplier is 3. We're told that income is taxed at a rate of 20 percent and we're trying to solve for the marginal propensity to consume. Here's our consumption function. Consumption equals A plus B multiplied by 1 minus the tax T, all multiplied by Y income. B is the marginal propensity to consume, and T is the income tax rate. We're going to be dealing with a closed economy. Income equals C plus I plus G, consumption plus investment plus government spending. And we're going to make a substitution for C, where we have C, we're going to replace that with the consumption function when we have income taxation. So making that substitution, and I and G we just leave alone. The next step, I'm going to take this term right here, this B multiplied by 1 minus the tax multiplied by income, and I'm going to move that to the left-hand side of the equation. So now it becomes minus over here on the left-hand side of the equation. And on the left-hand side of the equation, we're going to factor out a y term. We've got y and y here, so we're going to factor y out. And that leaves us with this result right here. The next step is we're going to divide through by what's in the brackets. So we're going to divide both sides through by what's in the brackets. We get this. Here's our last step. Now let's take the derivative of y with respect to g. That'll give us the government spending multiplier. So the derivative of a is just a constant, that's 0. The derivative of i is a constant, that drops out, that's 0. Uh, the derivative of g, it's just going to be 1. And that's going to leave us with 1 divided by what we have in the denominator here. So that is our government spending multiplier. Now in this problem, we're told that the multiplier is 3, and the tax rate is 20%. Let's make those substitutions. So the multiplier here on the left-hand side, that's 3, and the tax here is 0 0.2. Now we're going to solve this expression for b, the marginal propensity to consume. So simplifying up here a little bit, 1 minus 0 0.2 is 0 0.8. Just moving some things around here in the denominator. And now let's multiply everything through by what's in the denominator, this 1 minus 0, 0.8b. So the left-hand side then will simplify down to 3, and then 3 times minus 0, 0.8b gives us this. Moving this minus 2.4b over to the right-hand side, and then subtracting 1 from both sides, and now finally dividing through by 2.4, the marginal propensity to consume is 0 0.833. Okay, that's it.